Hello, I'm Georgie Barrett and this is your Week in Tech. London-based SaaS provider HiQ has raised $50 million. The company was founded in 2001 and has since expanded to New York, Frankfurt, Amsterdam, Sydney and Amidabad. HiQ provides enterprise collaboration and content management solutions to some of the world's leading law firms and financial services companies. Some 46 UK-based tech firms have made Bloomberg's first business innovators list. Startups Dudil and Duke Deck were among the companies on the unranked list, which aim to illustrate the strength and breadth of the UK startup community. The government have announced a new scheme to help cybersecurity startups. The £250,000 programme will be run in partnership by Cyber London and the Centre for Secure Information Technologies at Queen's University, Belfast. And in clean tech news, London, Bristol, Nottingham and Milton Keynes are to get a boost of cash to drive the adoption of electric cars. These cities are among the winners of a £40 million UK government fund. In the ongoing saga of big corporations are paying taxes, David Cameron has defended Google's 130 million UK tax deal. The deal was made by HMRC, but the Conservatives have argued that they have done more to crack down on tax evasion than their Labour predecessors. Something tells me this won't be the end of the multinationals tax debate. Our download of the week is Parentville. Parentville is a location-based app for urban parents looking for family-friendly activities, venues and facilities. It also helps new mum and dads to build a support network by connecting them with other local parents. And finally, a Google Artificial Intelligence program has beaten the European champion of the Chinese board game Go. In a huge breakthrough for AI, the tech company's DeepMind division has trained a computer to beat a human. And a little fun fact for you, there are more possible positions in Go than atoms in the universe. This has been your week in tech. For more, check out Tech City News and follow us on Twitter.